going to. I'm honestly done with Skyblock at this point. And I'm sorry if everyone liked me playing Skyblock, but I'm never going back. I honestly am just sick of it. I'm, I'm completely sick of it. This is the third time I got ratted. I didn't even do anything this time. The ratter somehow got into my account, and I didn't even do anything. I didn't download any mods, download do I didn't download anything. Didn't go to sketchy websites, didn't go into Discord, didn't verify anything. They got in my help account somehow again, deleted my profile, and everything's just gone. And I'm banned for like 27 years right now. But getting off that topic, I'm probably just gonna be doing Minecraft survival things. I'll probably do some Steam games. I mean, I don't know if anyone ever really likes me doing Minecraft. Normal, like normal Minecraft. I feel like everyone's only here for just Skyblock, but uh, I'm just going for a rough time having to deal with stupid Skyblock. And honestly, I think it's a good time that I can actually be like be done with that game because I'm honestly sick of it. It was fun until people, like people, just somehow get into my dang account and delete everything that I work for. And honestly, I'm just sick of it, because this is the third time this happened, and uh, I'm just honestly done. The other two times were my fault, but this time it was not my fault. I didn't do anything, and I don't know. And I can't get my account appealed because Hypex was dumb. But, I mean, with that being said, uh, I'm going to be doing Minecraft Hardcore uh, Mod Pack, which is called... Dark RPG. It's in Curse Sports. You guys want to go see it? I'll probably link it in the description. Too, but I don't think this can get any views or anything. But I'm gonna be doing like I'll be doing funny edits, or I'll try doing edits. I have to just get like a editing software for my thing. But I hope you guys enjoy me playing this. I don't know if I'm gonna be talking. How this works. This is a pretty fun mod pack, though. I'm um, not gonna lie to you. It's actually pretty fun. It's got like origins and stuff. Like you could be a blaze ward. There's like diff the, 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 the different um, origins. Look, like so you can spawn you like in different areas. Like uh, the one that I do did uh, in my in the server I play. I chose Blaze Ward. I spawned in the Nether, and I had to get back to the overworld. It had different abilities, like uh, I'm immune to fire or like lava, anything like that. But I take damage with water. I mean, the, it's honestly it's pretty cool. But it's got different kind of advantages. It's got different disadvantages, but. and stuff I'll have music and stuff with this but right now I'm like not gonna have audio you know because that's why I'm doing gonna be doing editing I'm gonna put my own I'm gonna put music in it because oh, I don't I really like hearing Minecraft's soundtrack that much see this is what I'm talking about so I could be a human which boring <laughs> boring avian Amy race has lost their ability to fly it yeah okay a long time ago now these peaceful creatures can be seen gliding from one place to another in feather way. You fall as gently to the ground as a feather would unless you sneak. Which means I won't take fall damage, basically. Fresh air. When sleeping, your bed needs to be in an altitude of at least 86 blocks so you can breathe fresh air. That's one of the disadvantages of it. Modifiers to your walking speed also apply while you're airborne. Tailwinds. You are a little quicker on your foot than others. Obviparas. I don't even know what that says. Whenever you wake up in the morning, you lay an egg, which is really weird. You can't digest meat, so you can only eat like vegetables or something. The equipment abilities and the, and the ability to trap their foes in spider web. Are pretty good hunters. Climbing, which would be G. Climb up any kind of wall, just not, not just ladders. 
master of webs you can navigate cobwebs perfectly so you're basically you're basically a spider but you're also technically speaking still human when you hit an enemy in melee they get stuck in web cobweb for a while knife arthropods stuck in the cobweb will be sensed by you you are able to craft cobweb from string carnivore you can you can't eat vegetables and you're restricted to meat and fragile you have less you have three less hearts than a normal human also a really horrible one a whitrin it also tells you the impact of what these are so the other ones human has no impact but these ones have more impact often flying around in the winds elytrins are uncomfortable when they don't have enough space above their head so that just means i have to have like a bunch of like it's it, 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 it's self-explanatory you have you have to have stuff above, uh, you can't have stuff above your head you have elytra wings without needing to equip any which i mean i mean that's not really it's not really that useful i wouldn't think gift of the winds every 30 seconds you are able to launch about 20 blocks up in the air i mean that part's pretty cool aerial combat you deal more damage while you're in a wider flight the, from, the problem with a, being in a wider fight while attacking is it's kind of harder to hit something at least for me it would be need for mobility you you cannot wear any heavy armor armor with protection values higher than chain mail. That part is kind of stupid. Claustrophobia, well, that's place type of cemetery. You can't be in an area full of ceilings or anything. Bro, a bunch take more damage from falling and flying into blocks. Horrible. Shulk. So you, related to shulkers, the body of the shulk are outfit with a, a protective like shell skin. Part a uh, hoarder. You have access to additional nine slots of inventory when keep the items on death okay that part sounds cool sorry sturdy skin i mean it's not like i can't if i die the, the game's just over so i it sounds cool but it's also really useless sturdy skin even without wearing armor your skin protect provides natural protection strong arms you're strong enough to break stones without using a pickaxe which is Cool. Uh, the way your hands are formed provide no way of, of holding a shield upright. You exhaust much quicker than, uh, than others, thus you must eat more. That's kind of annoying. Air. Oh my god. Immune to fire damage. You have a light draw. I'm not gonna like go in. I'm not reading every single thing on this. I did. If you wanna read it, I don't care. It is that confused with the normal blah, blah, blah. Skin has lightning running through it. What? Why does it not tell us you have one less part than humans? And fresh air thing again. Feline, see, now the impact's higher. Like appearance, acrobatics, you never take fall damage. That's honestly funny. You can go higher. Footsteps don't cause any vibration to the Nine lives, one less heart movement, three arms, pretty horrible. Creepers are scared of you. Slightly see in the dark. The nine water. Endron. Horns and capable of teleporting. Actually, that sounds pretty cool. You're vulnerable to water, of course. <laughs> Hydrophobia, you take damage with water. Wow. Teleportation with G. It deals no damage while you're teleporting. You're afraid of pumpkins for a good reason. Thunderbite, you can reach blocks and then it's far away. Warren and Green Thumb sneak through some unfertilized, fertilizable block. Okay. So if I hear me, oh, that'd be, that's dumb. Absorbing you. 
unplayable. You take twice more damage to fire. You can only consume body bottles? Wait, what? Trouble. Oh, heck, no, I ain't doing no trouble. You can breathe underwater. That's dumb. But not on land. Oh. <laughs> Your vision underwater is perfect. Aqua Fendi can break. Walks underwater as others do on land. Okay. Your underwater speed is increased. When underwater, you do not sink to the ground unless you want to. Voice horn. This is the one I chose before. I say before, but. So I already know what this does. It, it, it's actually pretty good, but for the problem is that you spawn in the nether. Five times. You're four times more than a regular human. Five blood hearts. Dude, this one's just built to die. You ride other players. Oh my god. Pickling. Okay, that one I've never heard of. All that glitters. One tool is to do extra damage and then go to armor. Your natural spawn will be in the nether, which also is horrible. Here, outside of the nether, you zombie fight and become undead. You can walk through the solid materials from Okay, that's you are invisible. Uh, you burn in daylight. If you're not invisible, oh. You can because it causes you to become hungry and you have what? Three less hearts. I like three less hearts. The heart thing is the one thing that concerns me about so many. Your skin is made of sculpt veins. Okay then. Double tap WSD. You get to dash. Fuck stab. Don't mid air. You were able to release a powerful blast. So this has got a lot of stuff to do with uh, the sculpt boy. You were able to reverse. You're capable of char changing shape to, to suit your needs, allowing you to amplify your speed and find more combat. When, when in speed mode, you're able to amplify speed. Lighting mode, evolution, sculpt shell. Your skin rejects any armor. Oh, what? Okay, that's something that would be a problem. More something to do with Skulk. I think I've actually been this character before. It's like really weird. Yeah, no. I, I don't like this one. Random. I would, I would do random, but I kind of want to see what this one does. Loglin is a pig when that died its skull. We want to the warrant It's able to see, but requires a skull catalyst to thrive. This one sounds really interesting, but also sounds like a problem. But I do really like the phantom. 
I could do Blazeborn again, but I really want to do something different. I think I might do the one with the teleporting. I don't know. Because the warden, that warden one, the warden is, it's not really a warden. I wish there was, that'd be funny. Oh, warden origin. The ender one lets you teleport. But why would that be useful? Piglin. Piglin, you would spawn in the nether, and I really don't like spawning in the nether. It was kind of annoying the first time I had to. Problem is, this one can't wear any armor. And I kind of need armor to live, sir. I don't want to be human either, though. I mean, I want to do something that's cool, but also don't want to have to be... In the nether. Also, why I think it's stupid. This is a hard choice. Large appetite. I'm gonna go with the shulker. Nitwit. Aren't really good at anything. Farmer. Bountiful. See, I would want to do one that has food since the skull boy doesn't have really any. He has a large appetite, which is a problem. He mines stone materials quicker than others. Jack, nah. Cook. Book crafted by you. More saturating. Blacksmith. What do you pray to fight small pups? Cleric. This is the one I usually choose. You're able to produce better enchantments at the enchantment table. But the problem with that one is, um, wait a second, explorer actually sounds like a good one. Warrior, eh, deal a bit more damage. Nah. Archer, one shot, one kill. Give increased accuracy. Nah. I'm not really worried about that. Beastmaster. Nah. Okay, there's only a couple. I think I might do... I really want to do Cleric again. Because the enchantments are better. But at the same time... Now nah, let's do Explore. Because you can't run out of... Uh, you don't run out of exhaust while sprinting. Also, why is my controls really switched?
I still have my cool emacs. Sword apparently, I can already got stone one. Oh, I already have armor on. Oh, I was like, what's up with that bar? Why is my bar so high from weather armor? I was like, oh, wait. So, so quests. I also might want to turn that sound down though. That sounds really loud. Turn everything down to like 50. Real Minecraft storage kids now. I flip. Actually, I'm gonna turn that music off though. I uh, don't. A wooden axe. Seems easy enough. Or I got a shield. See, it's not supposed to be completely hard, but it's also still hard. Same thing. I'll do that for food actually, because if I, I'm gonna have to make a farm. Crap, get two dirt, okay. Dirt off your shoulders. Bro, I'm just gonna be unlocking so many things. Alright, uh, we're done with that now. Uh, I don't know if I wanna go towards that fire. concerned if I was like, oh, wait, do I take damage from water? Hey, guys. Why, hello there. Oh, here you
end. how deep this cave is and then the order it ends I have only 
only been finding one pieces of freaking iron everywhere. What is happening? Oh, I heard an ender. Oh, there he is. I was like, I heard an ender boy. Where is he? God, it's actually something more useful than just one piece of iron. It's two. There's a geode right here. table like every other youtuber does <laughs> literally no that's like what every youtuber does it's just like uh it's like oh no i i need to get another crafting table and i'm like bruh you just had one five seconds ago just go back and grab it <laughs> now i'm having to go do it Freaking works. Can't drop lapis from iron. The lava here and some more random. Ooh. The lush. And there's also this. But, uh, I don't know if I really want to go down here. Finds the wardens. Finds the ancient city. I 
have scared myself by doing that. I I just got two diamonds again. Wait, what? Uh, it's only diamonds that are here. I also got seven diamonds. Yeesh. Diamonds probably better than this thing, though. I, I, <laughs> I made the amethyst sword, and I'm like, oh, I probably should just change the roof right now. I'm like, bruh, <laughs> Just made it. We have a diamond pickaxe uh, and a diamond sword, I guess. And even though I literally just made an amethyst sword for no reason. say something about me not being able to use a shield or something. Oh god, I've got more diamonds and whatever that is. Okay. Uh, just one? Really? What is that actually? Try not taking as much damage as possible. Something over here. I kinda wanna find more of this moonstone stuff. What is this moonstone? It does the same amount of attack damage as a do it one of these. Holy! Eight attack damage. Twelve! You can do twelve? What is that? Ward soul. Okay, yeah, I don't know what's going on here. Your 
You're unworthy. Ow. Sorry. Jeez. And I said you're unworthy and then you explode me. Okay, there's that. There's more diamonds. Drop a bow. First try. Uh, that might be a scam. How did it drop a bow first try? Also, why is that full durability? Stone pickaxe. Verglad? What is Verglus? What the heck is that? How am I gonna. How am I gonna find that? Is there something you can do with obsidian? Obsidian. There actually is. But iron's better. Crying obsidian. Which is still. My, ch my stuff's better. Yeah, yeah, no, no, my stuff's better. What is that? Crimson? I got another like 2.5 seconds, but I'm not going to. This, this isn't a Minecraft speedrun where I'm supposed to be speedrunning the game. I'm not trying. I did find like diamonds in like 2.5 seconds. And I should be a speedrunner. I should do one of those, those shorts like the other YouTubers do. It's like, hey, our goal is to find diamonds, me.